Hey everyone. So today we're working just on a 12 by 12 and we're going to do a reverse swipe. So colors I'm going to be using are PBO Iridescent Gold, Parage Posse Coral Reef. This is one of our new summer colors. This has a gold metallic in it. Chestnut Bronze Metallic has Parage Posse as well and Parage Posse Moody Blue Shimmer. This is uh, pretty much like our base with the uh, Gunmetal Metallic mixed in. So, let's see. Let's start with, it's always decisions what colors to start with, you know? Because it's going to be a flip cup to start with. If you've never seen me do a reverse swipe, then uh, this is your chance to see what it's like. So I do have um, white paint. I did thin down some of my pouring paint because I have no base mixed up yet. Always reuse my drink cups. Let's move this out of the way and let's fill our cup. I am going to spray this with the WD-40. This is the silicone spray that I have in my Amazon shop. Just a nice squirt will coat the cup. All right. So I think, let's go ahead and start with the coral. So this is just going to be a flip cup. And then we'll do the chestnut bronze. Then the gold. I love that PBO iridescent gold, it's pretty. And the moody blue. Some more coral. Chestnut bronze. Iridescent gold. And moody blue. Okay, let's move these out of the way. We're going to bring our canvas back with a flip cup. Give that a second to fall down while I grab my tool. This is just a putty knife, plastic putty knife. Alright, so now I'm going to pour my white around. Not so far up to the cup that um, it's in the way. But give it about an inch away. It's going to go to the middle anyway. Fill just a little bit more here. I have to have enough to pull over. I always leave a little bit just in case I need it. So now I'll flip this cup. You can see all that silicone sitting there. That might be an issue. Okay. So I don't like to like go down in and scoop. I just kind of like to grab the edge and pull it over. If you have a turntable, you could put that on there and just pull it over. Just swing it around each time. And my push pins always stick to these pads because I use the metal ones. See, silicone. Well, at least it's not hitting the canvas first, right? Alright, so I don't have a ton of white in the middle, which is a good sign. So I'm going to go ahead and torch. And then we're going to tilt, and I'm definitely going to get rid of that. I'm actually going to put a little white here so it doesn't hit the canvas as I tilt. So all my color is condensed right here. So what our goal is, is now just to open it all up and try to get some beautiful lacing. So I'm going to go ahead and get rid of that real quick. And I'll get my corner while I'm down here. Head to this one. Bring it all back to that middle. We don't want to lose the color underneath. It's all 
gonna kind of come up. And then we'll dump here. I might say dump. Why do I say dump? <laughs> Pour. I'm not liking that salt, so I'm gonna get rid of it. He's not pretty. Okay. So let's give it a torch. Ooh, there's some pretty runoff. I'm going to torch it. We're going to let it sit. We're going to see what develops while it's sitting. Sometimes when you do these, everything just pops up through that way, and other times it does not. You really have to let it sit. So what you're doing now is heating up that paint just the surface so the silicone can come up. I may have to tilt some more when I come back. We'll see. Right now, let's let it set for 10 minutes and see what we get. I'll be right back. Well, that didn't go as planned at all. <laughs> I 
think that's the first time um, a reverse swipe did not work for me. So I ended up going in and swiping. Um, I believe it might be because I used all metallics. They're too heavy. And uh, they just didn't want to cooperate. But doing a little swipe on there, I actually like that. The way it looks right now. So I'm going to leave it alone and give it one more torch. And probably get some more cells developing as it sits. Because this is thinning out now here. But yeah. It's kind of pretty. It's very flowy. The gold and the coral are showing up. Got some of that moody blue in there and that chestnut bronze. It's going to be pretty when it's dry. So that's it for this one, guys. We will attempt this again with different color palette later this month and see what we get. But that's it for that one. So check out all the links below. Shop with me on Amazon for your paint pouring supplies. There's so much stuff in there, you guys. And if you aren't looking for paint supplies, but you're still shopping on Amazon, go through my link and help me earn a few pennies on your purchases. And um, check out my Etsy shop. I have lots of paint in there and acrylic skin jewelry. Paintings are coming. Coasters are coming. Hopefully within the next week or so. But uh, join us Monday night, live at 9 p.m. right here on my channel. We do some live pouring, answer questions, joke around. We have a great time. We have our crew. Come be part of the crew. It's fun. All right, guys. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you all on the next one. Bye now.